You ready to fight? Ready. Do it. All right, all eyes on Armand Sarukyan as this round gets underway in earnest. Of course, all rounds begin on the feet where Sarukyan has said he believes he will have a decided advantage here tonight. But don't be surprised to see him grapple. He's very instinctive when it comes to his takedown game, and you know if he gets the fight there, it could be a real problem for his opponent tonight. Right to the former interim lightweight champ, Dustin Poirier, in a good striking throw here tonight, DC. That left hand nearly put his opponent out. Nearly puts him out, and you can't take many of them. Dustin's so big and physically strong for 155. I can't believe he's the fight at Feather. He looks like he could never have made that weight. He's found his home at lightweight, and you see the damage with one strike. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times, people throw singular strikes. Not this, gentlemen. This man is stringing four, five, six in a row. What a great job. Oh, nice low kick. Oh, man, both of these guys can really take a shot. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eight. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Dustin Poirier. Check your face, check your face. Sneaky body kick lands under the elbow. Solid punch lands for him. Just over three minutes to go. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Well, no denying that he rocked him, but couldn't quite get the finish. He hurt him real bad, but he couldn't find the shot that would put him to sleep. He threw a lot of punches, but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. Just misses with the jab there. Oh, big right hand, yes. All right, now we got some blood, ladies and gentlemen. It looks as though that shot has cut him open. Now we're in a fight. Let's now go. Now we're in a fight, John. I mean, you got the blood flowing. Guy's got a cut. Let's see how this fight plays out going forward. Just over two minutes to go in round one. He's hurt again. All right, opens the guard. Now stacked guard. Giannis, I now closing up. Unable to connect there. Try to establish that jab. Oh, it looks like he's trying to set up the takedown. There's the attempt. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, nice counter jab there. Got the single collar tie. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Poirier's eye is closing up now. Not good for him. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Sarukyan. Leg kick now. Back and forth we go. Do not back up. Let's go forward Well, at this point, DC, I'm not sure if he's just biding his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish them. It seems like the guy's playing with his food. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the zone. It feels like at any moment he can end the night of his opponent. But seems to be having fun, and hey, to each his own, I guess. I'd be rushing out of that after that. Yeah, you don't play with that. No. Oh! As his opponent postures up, he opens it. 
Solid Giannis. Cheek looks like it's cut. Yes, it is. Starting to bleed a little bit now. Horn oh. sounds for the end of round one. All right, so that's the end of the round. Potential adversity here. He's got a cut on his cheek sustained from that strike in the round. Now the focus becomes maximizing these 60 seconds, shutting that cut and preventing it from becoming a major factor here moving forward. All right, so a big knockdown for him courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well. But when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal. And if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. Ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, let's get to round two. Oh! Gets back to his feet. Oh, he hurt him again. Oh, this one could be over soon. Hunting steps in. One. One. What a fight. So how about that as he pounds him out for the TKO, prioritized the finish tonight, absolutely gets it with style points. A huge, huge result here in this arena tonight. It's always fun to see an athlete tell you what they're going to do, and then they do it. This guy told us he was going to get a finish, and that's exactly what he did. Him and his team are going to have a fantastic time tonight celebrating. They should all be very proud. And here once more, Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at nine seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Dustin the Diamond.